If you're new to waist training, getting started can be a little intimidating. I know I get a lot of questions from girls who aren't sure what to expect and don't know if they're wearing the garments correctly, so I put together this short guide to help. Even if you've been waist training for a while, you may find these tips helpful as well. So before you start waist training, you want to be confident that you're using a waist trainer that fits well. You can see my blog link in the description below for some sizing help. But generally, when you want more slimming power, you shouldn't size down. Instead, choose a waist trainer that offers a higher level of compression. One of the first things you'll notice when putting on a waist trainer for the first time is how strong the compression is. It may feel tight at first, but trust me, your body becomes used to it pretty quickly, believe it or not. If the material starts to roll or you see any bunching, the garment is probably too small. You may want to exchange it for a larger size or just save it for future use because after you've been waist training for a while, you may find it that you need a very smaller size. After you've chosen your type and verified that it does fit, start waist training slowly. Your trainer needs some time to break in and your body needs time to adjust. Begin with a looser fit for just an hour or two a day and then work your way up. Once you're comfortable, I recommend wearing the waist trainer for eight hours a day for your maximum results. There are a few different types of waist trainers and corsets. My favorite type is the one I'm wearing and it is a latex waist trainer from bodyshaperslifestyle.myshopify.com. They have a 15% off discount code if you use code MISSPERU, that's capitalized letters with only two S's. And these versatile ones are ideal for everyday use and they look great underneath clothes. Some are designed to also increase perspiration too, so make sure that you get the one that you uh, want for your own needs. Remember that everyone's body is different. If you're using a waist trainer as part of your existing fitness goals, then there are several factors that will affect your results. One, lifestyle. Two, diet. Three, intensity of workouts. Four, genetics. And five, your commitment to waist training. To get the most out of your results, I truly highly recommend a regimen that includes a healthy lifestyle and exercise in your diet. Um, one thing I forgot to mention, good news, is you'll already find yourself eating less because your stomach is constricted, so you'll get fuller faster. So make sure you still consume healthy meals and always drink lots of water. 
corset training at the end of the day it's truly about the love of the journey remember above all else to just listen to your body have fun and be good to yourself so that's it good luck babes